This is Coon Cassis for IFL TV, proudly sponsored by Everlast. We're in the matchroom bubble here in Manchester. I'm joined by Dalton Smith. All right, mate? Yeah, all good, thanks. How are you? Very well, thank you. How are you uh, getting on with bubble life? Um, it's my third one now, so you know, I'm settling in well. I'm used to my surroundings now, so it's another day at the office for me now. Absolutely. Um, I just spoke to uh, your opponent on Saturday night, Lee, at Apple Yard, and yeah, I find this fight very interesting from both angles. Why you would take the fight after only kind of six or seven fights, and why he would take the fight. So, from your perspective, you're trying to move on to that next phase of your career. Yeah, and like you said, there's a lot of people saying, "Oh, is, is it the right fight for Dalton now?" And you know, I've got a good team around me, and I feel like this is the perfect fight for me now. And you know, I breeze past all my recent opponents, and I feel like Lee's going to show show me more than what I have with my previous fights. So. That, that's what that's what I need, and that's why we rescheduled the fight back in. Obviously, talking to to Lee Appleyard there and Steffi Ball from the outside perspective, it's we know this is going to be a, a tough fight, but you're kind of expected to win from the outside boxing public within their team. They're very confident that that's not going to be the case. But there'd be something wrong, you know. If 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 his team wasn't confident, I wouldn't be taking the fight. So you know. I expect them to be confident. They've come to win. So, but you know, I, I, I believe this is a fight where you'll see, you'll see my, my potential and you'll see more, more of what I'm about. How do you think things have gone for you since you've turned professional? On paper, everything's good, but it seems you're learning as each fight develops. Yeah, and I think it's because you know every fight I've took now, it's, it's been a little step up, and especially with the first fight camp, um, you know, with the the back garden, Eddie's back garden. You know, I was able to take a fight, and I've always said when fighters come and they, they come to fight more, that's that's when you'll see the best of me because there's more openings. I've got more to, more to think about, and you know, that, that's when you see the best of me when my position moves up. You've got Steffi Ball sitting there. What's he said to you tonight? He keeps hanging about. I'm sure he's trying to get on my interviews. I think so. Yeah, uh, yeah. Steffi, come here, please. Look, straight away he's up. Come here. No, St Steffi. All right, I'm leaving all this in, Steffi. Steph, if you don't come now, it's going to look really, really bad because I'm leaving it all in. Come on, then. Come on, get in, get in. Get in. Oh, I've been working hard with Dalton for the last ten weeks. We've had a great training camp. It's been well, spar meant to tell you. <laughs> sparring, sparring's been going great. So really happy with how it's been going. He's working on a good jab. Left up to body, it's all come together just at the right time. You know, this is all mind games for him, isn't it? It's all mind games. He's, he's trying to fuck with your head. What? <laughs> come on, what's the questions? Oh, we'll see. We wanted to get you involved. I said to Dalton just there, what's Steffi been saying to you? He said he's just trying to get in on the interview. As soon as I said it, you were straight over. Yes, agreed, he was straight over. Yeah, you're making me sweat. Um, we just spoke there with Lee and kind of the reasons why each fighter would take the fight, but. Yeah. Um, and he was very honest, kind of where Dalton is. And Lee was saying as well, credit to Dalton for kind of yeah. taking this fight as well. Yeah. Well, facts are, when, when we finished, we uh, pulled out with COVID. Dalton had other options. He could have gone other ways. I went on about it with his dad early. And the, it's good of him to honour the fight because Lee, during pandemic, has been at gym throughout consistently. And almost, almost two years we had a fight. And we, if he went another route, Lee wouldn't have had a fight. And they've honoured the fight, and so we're, we're here. I've known Dalton since he's been a young kid. I've, I've, man, I've managed some of the fighters in Grants, and I've seen him come through. We know what kind of fight it's going to be, and that's the truth of it. We, we've been having crack earlier. When it comes down to it, both of them will go to war on Saturday night, and uh, what will be, will be. And they'll be shaking hands like they are in here. There's no bad blood. It's just, it's just a fight, mate, and they, they've given us an opportunity. Well, Grant won't do interviews, so he says. So you, 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 do you want to? Beautiful. <laughs> Beautiful. Get on it, Dalton. It's going to be funny corners. That's we have crack about that because I'm very vocal and uh, Grant's very vocal. But this is the best thing about boxing that people don't see. They see you go to war on a fight night, but beforehand there is a lot of respect. As you yeah. even sitting here with Dalton now, you said you've known him since he was a kid, but there's a lot of respect. We, well, we've, we're from. Uh, we're not from cities, we're like connected in, in South Yorkshire. And like you said, Grant trains a lot of fighters over the years who I manage. He, he looks after them. So I'm on phones quite regularly with Grant. They're very supportive to, to... He only messaged me last week when Gavin were fighting, wishing us best of luck. So uh, 
it's just it's not it's weird because it's not we're here in a relaxed mode but we know what job in hand what jobs in hand and like you say they're giving us respect like they're getting from us Darren Barker just loitering around he's here. He's trying to get in, isn't he? He's just trying to get in and ruin it for us. Try and jump in. Well, okay, as pleasant as this is and as respectful as this is, give me a prediction of what's going to happen from each side on Saturday night. Lee's going to run for 10 rounds, um, throw about three shots around, and Dalton's going to chase his right ring. What do you reckon, Dalton? I'm going out front foot, and Lee's going to keep me on jab for the rest of the <laughs> yeah, fight, isn't that's he? That's it, yeah. Listen, cool, it is what it is. We're having a fight, mate. Fuck off, let me go. <laughs> let me get out. You won't even back your man. Come on, awesome. come on and tell us. Listen, we're here to win. He's had 10 weeks of training his bollocks off. We're going to be chasing him all over the ring and trying to wallop him in knackers back at head and everything. I like me, go. That's what we That's wanted what to win. doing it. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking leave it out, cool. <laughs> oh, dear, oh, dear. Oh, um, yeah, final word from you. Uh, you're very confident ahead of Saturday, Dalton. Yeah, definitely. Like I said, you know, all respect there for Lee and Steffa. It's just business, and you know, I'm confident, and you know, this is where you're going to see my class. You know, I think Steffi think they've got me while I'm early in my career, but they've got me at my best. That's how you got to look at it, ain't it? it, it we're not, we're honest people. You you've got to look at him, his inexperience and championship fight the round. We know, we all know what it is. And listen, it, it, it's a fight, mate. He's a special talent. Is, is, is he ready for to step up? And is, it's one of them, isn't it? <laughs> he's trying to psychologically break you down three days before the fight. He is, is, isn't he? He's the only one sweating here. Look. <laughs> he's sitting there cool as a cucumber. Oh, mate, it's cost me comb off it's coming down. I figured I've been on here long enough now. And they've noticed my hair's dropped. Listen, mate, you both come out the ring safe on Saturday night, put on a great show, and listen, may the best man win. Cheers. I'm not fighting, like, but thanks. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> Kept not, you hanging, making man. me feel like I'm fighting here. <laughs> Bless you, Steffi Dalton. Thank you very much for talking to Eiffel TV, and we'll speak to you after the fight on Saturday.